Okay, kiddos, it's me, Dawn the Kitchen Witch, and this is vlog number two, or uh, as we have determined, vlog, vlogging, vlogalicious, vlogtacular. Oh, I like that. This is my vlogtacular vlog, uh, which we have lovingly titled Dip, Eat, Love. And this is number two, and I'm just going to do it because you guys watched the first one, so yay, thank you. So yesterday, I went blueberry picking, and it was awesome. Many of you might know that I uh, have no life because I run this business, and I'm a little crazy all the time, and I don't generally get a weekend off, but I had a weekend off. And my husband Justin and I went blueberry picking in Maine, which was really cool because I didn't even realize I lived as close to Maine as I do. It was only like an hour. And it was spectacular. And I took my shoes off and I ran around in the field like a child, which I often do when and if I ever have the free time to run around and play in the dirt. I will always take my shoes off and I will always feel the earth between my toes and just I just love it so much so we went blueberry picking and I bought all of the blueberries well, I picked all of the blueberries and then I paid for them um, so I, I didn't buy them I guess I did buy them but it was awesome I had so much fun and I can't believe I've never done that before I, I've never been blueberry picking where I'm from on Long Island there's no real place to go blueberry picking and the closest farms are like really 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 far from where I used to live and they're super crowded and by the time you get there there's nothing left anyway so it's always more of a pain in the butt because you you look you, you'll be driving by you'll be sitting in traffic for like ever on sound avenue which if you're from long island you know exactly where that is and it's a pain in the ass and you'll be in stop and go traffic and you'll see all the people on on the side of the road and they're picking berries or they're picking pumpkins or whatever they're doing and you're like oh that looks like fun until you realize there's 150,000 people and like four berries um so this was so cool because we got there we like followed a sign we saw a sign on the side of the road we were just driving through Maine and we saw the sign on the side of the road that said pick your own blueberries and we just followed each sign until we found where we were going and it was awesome and there was nobody there and then I got home and I baked all of the muffins and I have so many more muffins that I'm going to bake and I'm going to make blueberry buckle and I'm going to make blueberry pie and blueberry cobbler and I'm even going to make a salad tonight. I'm going to make a salad with grilled chicken and fresh lettuce from the farm. Uh, there's like a really great little local farm stand that I just found called Policy Brook Farm. If you live local to the Salem area, Salem, New Hampshire area, you should totally try it because the tomatoes are outrageous and you know how I feel about tomatoes. So I'm going to make a salad with lettuce from Policy Brook Farm and grilled chicken and I'm going to put fresh blueberries and goat cheese in it and some of our Cucina Aurora lemon oil and a little bit of lavender balsamic. I cannot wait. I am so excited to go home and to eat it. I will take pictures. I will put the recipe online and you will love it and it will be fantastic. And I guess I should say something poignant about blueberry picking and how it was so cool to be so close to the earth and then go home and cook with these things and many of you might know that I don't have a garden which sucks because I live in this tiny little apartment and I don't have a garden but if I had a garden I would grow things in it and I would pick the things and then I would cook with the things so that's why I'm super passionate about buying things locally and going to local farms and stuff like that because it's still alive and there's Justin and I out in this field picking blueberries yesterday. I was totally not dressed for being out in a field and neither was he. He's wearing like combat boots and long jeans and I'm in like a flowy skirt and a black shirt. It was redonkulously hot. Um, but it was so much fun and I can't wait to do it again. So um, pick blueberries, pick strawberries. It's summer. All this stuff is in season. It's the first harvest. Pick things, post them on Facebook, let me see what you're doing, I'll show you my pictures, you show me your pictures, and it will be a love fest of berry picking. Thanks for watching, you guys. Go enjoy your food, dip, eat, love, and all that good stuff. Bye!